My name is Aaron Jani, President of the Zimbabwe Rugby Union. Welcome to Sables TV. Hello everyone, I'm Dan Ford Ntamangira, I'm the Zimbabwe Rugby National Team Captain. Welcome to Sables TV. Uh, right now the mood is very, very good. It's very high. Everybody's excited. We are all excited and uh, having PDV on the board as well. Um, you know, it has just changed uh, everyone's mindset. We have uh, now uh, taken on Peter de Villiers um, into the fold. We, 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 we think this is the beginning of exciting times for Zimbabwe, right? Yeah, we needed somebody who understands the game of rugby. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, we went out there and, and, and went to look for somebody who know what Zim rugby is all about. When I spoke to Stanley, um, on my appointment, um, what do you know about Zim Rugby? Didn't know anything about Zim Rugby. A week after that, he called me and said, what do you, know about, what do you want to know about Zim Rugby? <laughs> so we went to study from 1916, went to YouTube, went to study it. And with his pedigree and with what we do want to play here, um, the situation, trying to, to, to occupy the spaces, Change a bit the, the, the mindset of, of playing wide, wide without any uh, purpose. He's the right guy to take us to where we want to be. Um, I'm surrounded now with two, two great, uh, great assistant coaches. So yeah, with Stanley here, I am a bit more at ease, and um, I can apply my mind to more, more things. Because nowadays a head coach has, has so much to do. Um, other than, than the game and have people around you who understand what we, where we want to go, what we want to do, you make it so much easier for us. So now we tell the forwards, come again, again. So what is our policy? Forwards, forwards, and that ball must be quick. Uh, we can't do this on our own. Um, it takes the whole country to, to, to be behind the Sables. Um, it's about the, the, um, the government, it's about uh, the fans, it's about um, the coaches, it's about the players. Everybody has to come on board. The uh, Sables Trust is essentially a special purpose vehicle. Uh, and as the name implies, it's a legal entity, a, a, a trust. I won't go into the details of that. Safe to say that it's an entity, it was formed uh, last year, in July last year, if I'm not too wrong. But that came about from um, this law firm, Titan Law's uh, involvement in sport, particularly rugby itself. I think the Zimbabwe Rugby Union had uh, essentially approached us to help with the national side, and in particular raising funds for it. Our ultimate goal as the union and the team is to qualify for the World Cup. Our last campaign was in 1991, and we want to get back into world rugby. not easy, other teams are improving and uh, we have to set a bar for ourselves as well. The trust's main purpose is to look after the interests, uh, logistical and financial, of the national men's side. This is the rugby side. So what the public will start to see is a more professional approach with respect to how the national, the national side handles itself. You will certainly see in the coming days the announcements with respect to the sponsors that have come on board. You will see, um, I mean, everybody knows we've hired a top uh, level coach, that's Peter De Villiers, ex uh, Springbok coach. We've got Brandon Dawson, another very well respected and passionate coach. Um, and there'll be a constituted uh, a, a technical committee uh, looking after the Sables. But all of those people are also looked after by the Sables Trust. Their salaries are coming from there. 
their travel allowances are coming from from there and that's just not the technical stuff but even the players themselves uh, the packages that they're going to get have been upped from uh, what they were getting last year um, and that's on field and off field packages um, you but let me put it this way you'll see a more professional approach and certainly more visibility with respect to what Zimbabwe rugby is doing and specifically disables themselves. <laughs>